On Thursday, Neutron became the first Cosmos blockchain to use replicated security. Replicated securities allow blockchains in the Cosmos ecosystem to rely on the Cosmos Hub's validator set for security. Instead of the blockchain maintaining its own security via a network of validators, this is how it works. Blockchain in the Cosmos ecosystem can exist and achieve their goals, typically focusing on providing one type of service or application in a cost-effective manner by relying on Cosmos Hub. Neutron is a platform for issuing smart contracts via Cosmosm, a computational environment in the Cosmos ecosystem. Neutron intends to provide cross-chain smart contracts application for the Cosmos ecosystem by collaborating closely with the Cosmos Hub and benefiting from its high security. The Neutron team said that replicated security will bring more value to the Cosmos Hub and enable the development of complex and diverse applications for Atom, the native asset of the Hub. According to a May 11th announcement for the Metal Blockchain team, the Federal Reserve's upcoming instant payment service FedNow will be connected to Metal Blockchain. According to the announcement, the integration will allow Metal users to instantly convert funds to stablecoin and back using FedNow's Send Receive function. FedNow is a payment system developed by the Federal Reserve of the United States. It enables round-the-clock near instant payments between banks. Currently, US residents can only make domestic instant payments using third-party apps such as PayPal and Venmo or crypto wallets. The Federal Reserve has stated that the new service will be available in July. Metal Blockchain is a crypto network developed by Metallicus based on a fork of Avalanche's code. It was created to offer compliance-friendly options for decentralized finance developers. The Chinese government has established the National Blockchain Technology Innovation Center in Beijing to foster blockchain technology research. The Chinese government intends to support the development of breakthroughs in blockchain technology by establishing this research center, which was first announced in February. However, the country continues to maintain a nationwide ban on cryptocurrencies. The research center, according to Kitco.com, will collaborate with local universities, think tanks and blockchain businesses. To achieve its objectives, the institution intends to train more than 500,000 blockchains and DLT specialists. The Beijing Academy of Blockchain and Edge Computing will run the center, which developed the Chainmaker, a local blockchain supported by a consortium of Chinese companies, including China Construction Bank and China Unicorn. The government of China has launched the National Blockchain Technology Innovation Center in Beijing to support blockchain technology research. According to Kitco.com, China's recent efforts are in line with its vision to create blockchain technologies with Chinese characteristics. In the upcoming special segment on artificial intelligence, we will update you about the following news. Meta announces generative AI-powered product suit for ads. APT Bot launched a real AI quantitative trading bot. Romania harnesses AI for data-driven policy recommendations. Stay tuned for more updates.